first cut the tape that holds the wires together that allows us to pull the white and orange wires out of the harness. cut anything between the white and orange so we don't damage the other wires. Okay. So now that all the tape's gone. Mm -hmm. These two will just come loose. Okay. You can see the white and the orange wires are not taking them loose. Now we'll cut the two thicker blue and black wires that have the unshielded quick connects. Okay. And cut them at two different lengths as shown. Tape up the ends of the wires just cut. We also take those that blue and black wire together as shown. Repeat. In the end, we should have the one black power line, mm -hmm. the one brown wire with the female quick connect, mm -hmm. a blue wire with a male quick connect, mm -hmm. and a black wire with a female quick connect. Okay. Now we move to the red side. Again, remove the tape connected the wires. Leave those two connected at the end. Okay, remove the two wires that go to the elements as shown. Cut those two at different lengths. And again, tape up the ends and tape those two cut wires together. Go ahead. What we'll have left is this red wire with the female quick connect for the capacitor. This for the fan. The connectors and wires for the power to the board. Mm -hmm. And then the neutral and ground connections for the power. Right. Okay. Now, and these are for... Uh, now group all the wires back together for each side and tape them together. Yes. Kind of went to that. I want to say. Yeah. See you.